What's going on everybody? Welcome back. I'm Braden Strider and today we're going back into Roblox and I found this horror game that is definitely cool. Um, but as usual, I attempted to play it by myself and it didn't go so well. It's definitely a game for multiple people. But I need to, I need to share my attempt with you. So... Here it is. All right, I think I might uh, give this one a shot. Lost rooms, pool rooms. I think it's going to be somewhat based on the back rooms, but it looks like you go th through different rooms and there's something chasing you and you got to, I guess you got to kill it. I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll see if we can kill it or if we just have to escape it. This video was brought to you by you and do. If you're seeing this, you and do has promoted you from inmate to rank five mobile task force agents. Congratulations. Becoming a mobile task force agent means you'll be drafted into the project Lost Rooms. Your job is to eliminate and neutralize the different creatures that habit within the different zones. Doing so will enable us to get a better understanding of the zones and the creatures. Once you've cleared a zone, jump into the breakpoints. They are the connection between each zone. Breakpoints will bring you back home to zone zero. We've installed two panic rooms in each zone, where you can hide, we will supply weapons and food, for you throughout the days. You have nothing to worry about. We will keep you safe. Good luck. That's not creepy. I like how it was like, to fight, to die. Click the rooms button to play the game with your friends or random people in a server. Okay, create your own room. Let's let's do create. All right, so different um, different maps. Where there's an endless mode. Player versus player. Let's do normal. Let's start off with zone one. Um, let's go. Let's try normal. I get a uh, go solo. I wonder what the stars mean. Eh, they're all four stars. So anyway, oh, let's just let's go in. Let's figure this out. Caution. The game contains element of horror, flashing lights, and jump scares. Turn your volume and your graphics to the highest setting possible. Morbid Games is not responsible for any damage inflicted on the player. Have fun. Oops, I didn't... Was it loading something? I didn't... Oops. Viewer discretion is advised. I know the instructions. Run around, don't die. Simple as that. Oh, that's promising. You got this thing on the floor. Stay still to gain stamina back. Yeah. Ooh, an item box. Click R to whistle. <laughs> Allows your friends to locate you easily, but it also attracts creatures. Well, since I'm by myself, I probably won't be using that. Click F for flashlight or night vision if you own the game pass. Okay. Click space to see your backpack and craft items. Ooh, there's crafting in this game. I like that. That's cool. Nice. All right, is that it? All right. All right, so where are we headed first? Let's head towards the item box. That makes... That makes the most sense. Use all the supplies we can. Fabric pile. Can we, oh, we can pick that up? Is it in our... Where'd it go? I don't have it in my bag. It's not in my hands. Okay. 
the uh, the music is not very comforting. I don't know how well you can hear it, but I turned it up a little bit, so I don't know. I don't know if you can hear it. <laughs> I was like, "Is that a monster?" Ooh, water. That's uh, that's always good. Ooh, more water. What is this? Glass pile. I don't know if I should be closing the doors or not. Oh man, they don't. They don't stack. It's a camera. Panasonic. Not bad. Not too shabby. I'm afraid. <laughs> Hello? Ooh, donut! Yum, 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 yum. Can we open this? Nope. Right, we haven't run into anything yet, so. Coffee. I mean, will that make us, like, run faster? The caffeine or something? No, lights don't work. Exit. That says exit. What the heck? Is this the, is this the same room that we... No, it's different. Okay, yeah, it's def... Okay, it's different. For a second, I was like, are we just going in a circle? Oh, that's uh, that's just um, soda. <laughs> okay, so I got that all. What what can you craft? Ooh, bear trap, shotgun, revolver ammo, flamethrower ammo, Uzi ammo. But I want to get out of this room because that's really creepy. Oh, but I don't want this in my hand. How do I get it out of my hand? I don't want it in my hand. Err. I don't know. I'm going to keep the water out. I'm assuming water might heal me. I'm stable at 100%. Oh, uh, okay. This is better. This looks a little bit newer. Not as not as creepy. Let's see what the heck? Uh, let's see. Nope. Oh, no, no, there's a health bar. Nope, nope, uh-uh, I don't want any of this. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm still alive. Close that door. I'm gonna start closing doors. <laughs> I don't have. Anything to fight them with. I mean, I can make some bear traps, but that's it. I don't have any weapons or anything. Close, please. Okay. So. Still stable at 78%. Where are the panic rooms? Let's let's play. What do you wish to play? What the heck? What the heck? Ah! Leave me alone! It's fast! No. Oh, jeez. 
It's relentless. No! <laughs> uh, I don't even know how to use this water. Oh, I used it. Did it heal me? No, it doesn't heal me. I just, it just... This game has thirst and hunger. Jeez. It's still coming. I need to figure out how to make a weapon. Jeez, it's coming. I have no idea what I'm doing. Can I hide in there? Nope. <laughs> nope, it said no, you ain't hide. This ain't the panic room. We ain't gonna tell you where the panic room is either. What is that? Uh, just more food. Oh, come on. I don't know. What is that beeping? Does that mean it's close? Oh, shows where my last death is. I wonder if he responds. What? Where's my flash? Oh, did I lose my flashlight? Oh, no. <laughs> I'm about to say. Alright, can I... Close all of these. Alright, they're all closed. Here's all my stuff. Is that my head? <laughs> so I'm assuming he can't get through. This needs... Oh, this is the panic room! Duh! This is the panic room. Are you serious? Is this the same room I was in before? Because if so, then I just did a stinking circle. Or it was right there. Disaster alert. Deadly gas. Spreads across zone one to prevent dying from the gas. Quickly craft a gas mask. If you use the same mask for too long, it will eventually break. Watch a video. What the heck? I didn't sign up for this. This video was brought to you by you and do. Warning, minor breakpoints detected. It is suspected that poisonous gas will leak into Zone 1 tonight. Breathing it in will gradually damage your insides, and visibility will be decreased during this period. Make sure you craft a gas mask to survive, though be prepared the mask is not permanent. That's all the information we can provide, good luck. Jeez. Okay. 
So, how do we do that? Craft. Gas map. Protection? Not enough materials. I got the fabric. Titanium. So I need metal. I need one more thing of metal. Yes! So let's craft that. Um, how do we equip it? Oh, okay, there. I'm, I'm going to save it until I have... until I can see gas coming. Because uh, I don't know when the gas is going to be coming. Anything I can so can I make weapons? Oh I can I can actually make weapons an upgrading bench. I guess a revolver's better than nothing. I need 30 wires and 20 metal. I've got a bunch of metal and wires left to find. Oh jeez. Not the music again. So is it like you get to a certain point and it kind of goes away? And then you make it here to the music place? <laughs> and then he comes back, he respawns? Because if that's the case, I, I'm not ready to go back yet. I need to find more stuff. If I would have known, I would have been collecting a lot more from the from the get-go. I guess I don't really have a choice. Guessing the lights will shut off. Gunpowder pile. Or maybe I have a certain amount of time before it shuts off and it respawns maybe? I don't know. I don't know, but I gotta start finding more stuff to collect because I'm going to need to make a weapon. I haven't seen any gas yet either. So, I mean, that's kind of a good thing. Let me drink some water. I've been here. The doors are open. Yes, 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 yes. Take as many of the wires as I can. Uh, I think... I think I got all the wires. How many wires do I have now? Uh, wires. 37. So I have enough of the wires. Now I need... 13, 13 more metal. Can, can I go? I did not open that. Can I go up those stairs? Oh, jeez. Ah, oh, crap. Can I go up these stairs? Nope. Nope. I cannot. Ah. Oh, gas. Crap. Uh, it's on me. Ah! Ah! ah. Energy blackout! I can't... I died. <laughs> oh, that... This is not good. I am not doing well. Wait, then I don't have a gas mask. I'm just gonna die. 
Ah, oh, crap. Can I make another one? I don't have enough material to make another one. You can make walls and doorways? Huh. This game seems really awesome. But... But I'm dying. <laughs> what happened to the generator? Why is it taking so long? Come on. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm gonna die. The gas is gonna kill me. This monster's gonna kill me too. Ah! Dang it! Oh, there you have it, folks. Uh, it was a fun game. There's a lot more to it than I actually got to do, where you can make walls and doorways and craft a whole bunch of other stuff that I didn't get to do. Um, I didn't really know what I was doing starting off, so if I did, I think I would have been able to make a weapon quicker and be able to actually do some damage to the monster. But it has some neat aspects to it with the gas and the generator and it's definitely a game that's going to be a lot easier with friends playing with other people so i may have to give that a shot but i'll also want to try again single player because i think maybe on easy <laughs> maybe on easy i can actually beat it we'll see i'm gonna to have to try it out but make sure you press that notification bell so you know when new videos are up don't forget to like and subscribe and until the next one i'm seeing you